Hey guys, welcome back. So Samsung is finally adding a great feature just like we have on the Galaxy S22 Ultra where this feature will enhance the overall user experience with the S Pen. Also this year, Samsung is planning to use a latest gen CPU on the Z Fold 4 and Z Flip 4 instead of having the same CPU as the S22 series. Now before we jump into the video, I wanna say that if you haven't subscribed to this channel, make sure to subscribe to get more daily updates and give a like if you enjoy watching this video. So many of us are really excited about the S Pen feature on the Z Fold 4 which will come integrated inside of this beautiful device. We all know that the upcoming folding device by Samsung will have a dedicated slot for the S Pen which again is an appreciated move by the company. But according to latest report, Samsung will add super low latency with the S Pen like we have on the S22 Ultra right now means the Z Fold 4 will get 2.8 millisecond response time with the S Pen and this is going to be an exciting feature where users will feel a buttery smooth writing speed. Also last week we heard that Samsung will be using super ultra thin glass for the inner display of the Z Fold 4 to make it even more stronger than the previous device as well as to make it feels like a glass. Also the production of this latest S Pen has already started in Europe which 100% gives us confirmation that the S Pen is definitely coming integrated inside the next folding phone. Now jumping on to the performance part, it is almost confirmed that both the Z Fold 4 and Flip 4 will get Qualcomm's high-end CPU. This CPU will come very very soon which will bring some major improvements over the previous CPU. We all know that the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 available on the S22 series and many other flagship devices isn't doing well when it comes to heavy CPU tasks and gaming as well. It has some heating issues which is a big problem right now for many flagship devices and this is the reason why companies throttle some of the applications and games. But now, the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 Plus CPU will use TSMC's 4 nanometer fabrication over the Samsung's one which is expected to be pretty stable in CPU performance and has better heat management. Where the biggest example of this is the Dimensity 9000 based on TSMC's 4 nanometer. So the Samsung Z Fold 4 will solve all the thermal issues and will offer stable and consistent performance. Moving on, last week we got some updates regarding the display panels where we may not see any changes in terms of screen size compared to its predecessor. However, both the Galaxy Z Fold 4 and Z Flip 4 will have the second gen LTPO display panels which can go from 1Hz to 120Hz depending on the content being displayed and also it'll help to save some battery in the longer run. So that is it in this video guys, do let me know your thoughts in the comment section about the next folding device. If you end up liking this information then do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel as well. I'll catch you in the next one. Till then, peace out.